All right, guys, welcome back to uh, more South Park Stick of Truth. King Douchebag. King Douchebag? Is that what you told them your name was? Why didn't you tell them your real name, Dovakin? What? You don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zaron. Give it back. Fighters of Zaron? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, God. <laughs> Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? <laughs> this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is, until four years ago when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. Farts? No. His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. Before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. You have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? <laughs> so different, you and I, Dovahkiin. Uh... You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. <laughs> but then... I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! <laughs> anything! Anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! Uh... I control the universe! Uh No, I don't want to follow him. Ah, uh, 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 damn thing. How does it work? Show me how it works. Yeah, right. <laughs> Dovahkiin, why should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. I can offer you all just get me safely out of here. You can rule with this once again. <laughs> you underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes, and that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> Princess Kenny. At least one of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kenny? Because Princess Kenny was born a half orc, whose entire <laughs> village was wiped out by humans and elves. <laughs> <laughs> you see, when humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, an elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child. A beautiful little girl. A girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted all this time. To take the stick from you. For Princess Kinney is true heir to the stick of truth. Wow, that's pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Princess Kitty, come back here! Alright, uh, can... so we're gonna go this way. And then, oh, chef. I don't. 
Fucking ninja stars. <laughs> Alright, we are actually gonna... Uh, shoot. Okay. Just get some bleeding. Remove. Uh, that still does more damage. So... I guess, uh, we're gonna go... Yeah, 250, why not? Okay. What I need... I don't care about Thief Hood of Sneakiness. We're gonna go down a... Well, well actually, the hat really doesn't matter. Um, max HP by 250. Nah. We're gonna go Valkyrie Headband. And we're gonna... Man, that's pretty cool. Uh, we're gonna go Makeover Outfit. And then we're also gonna go... Makeover accessory. And then that should be everything. There we go. Okay. Can't talk to him. Okay. Is there any way... I would assume that there would have been a... Uh, Chin Pokemon here or something. Okay, let's... Nope, can't go back. Damn. All right. Okay, I guess we'll go this way. What can I interest you in some of my wares? Sure. What do you got? Flare. Clyde Wake. Hot Topic Catalog. Bayonet. Oh, wow. Okay, we're gonna do this. There we go. And how much are revive potions? Three bucks. There we go. Um, and we're actually gonna go with uh, Jimmy first. All right, let's go. Give us the stick, Princess Kenny. You don't want to go down like this, Raph. <laughs> Princess Kenny. <laughs> this is silly. Oh boy. This battle will get split in half, because I know I'm not going to be able to finish it all. Good, I got Diorate still. Perfect. Alright. Um... Yeah, backstab. There we go. And... Brown note. Behold the relaxing power of music. Alright. There we go, two grand. Wow. Okay, backstab because he's bleeding. There we go. Alright. Uh, we will go with a small health potion. And then, uh, yeah, why not? Eyes on the apple. There once was a maiden from st 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 Stoneberry Hollow. There we go. She didn't talk much, but boy did she sw boy did she swallow. I had a nice man that she said that set up her. The maiden from Stoneberry who is also, also your mom. mom. Wow, what a terrific audience. Wow. That uh that did the thing. So let's uh cure potion him. And then uh another backstab. There we go, look at that. Nine thousand damage. Yeah. 
There we go. I mean, he's gonna... Oh, he didn't die. Alright. Now he is. Perfect. <laughs> All right, so now we get to do this again. And I think he has more hit points this time. This is it, King Douchebag. The final battle. Your buddies stand with you. I would just stand over here. You jerk. Use your rainbow Ooh. attack, Princess Kitty. Man, he has a lot more defense now. Okay, we are going to small health potion. And then backstab, because bleeding is always good. There we go. Power cord. An amazing feat of skill. Oh, that yeah, that gives PP. Oops. Alright. Um brown note then. There we go. Wow, what a terrific target. I'm more than likely just gonna keep doing the same things. Wow. Alright. Uh use another small health potion on him. Sugar. And then uh backstab again. There we go. Oh, no, no, not large. This is why I kept so many small health potions. Because they deal, or they do, just enough. Time to warm up the crib. There once was a maiden from St 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 Stoneberry Hollow. All right, there we she go. She didn't talk much, but boy, did she swoop. Boy, did she swallow. I had a nice man that she said that. There we go. From Stoneberry, who is also your mom. I'm more than likely going to keep doing the same thing over and over again. And just constantly, uh... And just keep, like, backstabbing him, because my backstab does more, uh, damage. Oh, I missed. Okay. Item. We'll use a large health potion on him. There we go. Yeah, like, look at that. We do 8,000 damage now with that. And, okay. Um, small health potion on him. Get him to max, and then, I guess, the crossbow. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Guinea! Alright. And backstab should finish it off. There we go. Oh my god! You killed Kitty! Yeah, that oh, no wait, he's back. <laughs> Hit them with the zombie vomit! Oh, he killed me! I'm glad I bought quite a few revive potions. Uh, let's switch to butters for the turn. Tip your serving range. Yeah, I hope you guys don't get angry, but I just not you. Alright, small health potion. Backstab. There we go. Professor Chaos. There we go. 
This will do some good damage. Eh, 2,000. Okay. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Guinea! Alright. Just constant small health potions. And then backstab. There we go. Uh, wait. Yeah, here we go. Bonus damage. Death comes for you, Dragonborn. You'd better pray for a miracle. Whoa. There we go. Ooh. How can this be? We stand together against the darkness. Well, that chaos energy is making me a little woozy. All right. Backstab again. There we go. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kitty. I'm gonna need to get me some power points there. So, power potion on you, and then uh, yeah, why not? Ready? Aim! Fire! Eh, two grand. Okay. Backstab. Oh, so close. Hit them with the zombie vomit. Alright, there goes that section of Princess Kenny. I think all the dying is making her tired. Keep killing her. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Kenny. Alright, there we go. Alright, so uh, we're gonna stop it here. I'd hate to do this, but we're getting kinda long in the video, and we will finish this in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you then.